There's an interesting question about leaders. Uh, I've talked to Vitalik Buterin. I'll probably talk to him again soon. He's uh, one of the leaders, maybe one of the faces of the Ethereum project. And it's interesting. You have uh, uh, Satoshi Nakamoto, who's the face of Bitcoin, I guess, but he's faceless. He, she, they. <laughs> it does seem like in our, whatever it is, maybe it's 20th century, maybe it's Machiavellian thinking, but we seek leaders. Leaders have value. Linus Torvald, the leader of uh, of Linux, um, the open source development a lot. I mean, there's no, it's not, it's not that the leadership is sort of dogmatic, but it's inspiring and it's also powerful in that through leaders, we propagate the vision. Like it, the, the vision of the project is more stable. Maybe not the details, but the vision. And so do you think there's value to, because we're, we're, there's a tension between decentralization and leadership, like and visionary. Yes. Do, wh what do you make of that tension? Okay, so I really believe <laughs> that if it's a, another great question, I think of it, you know, uh, I really believe in the power of emotions. I think the, the, the emotions <laughs> are of a creative impulse uh, yeah. of, of everybody else. And very, therefore, it's very easy for a leader to be a, a, a physical person, a real being, and uh, that uh, interprets our emotions. And by the way, this emotion has to resonate. And what is good is that the, very, 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 the more intimate our emotions are, the more universal they are, mm. paradoxically. Yeah. The more personal, the more everybody else <laughs> yes. somehow magically agrees and That's feels a bit of the same. And so, and it's very important to have a leader in, in the initial phase that generates out of nothing something. That is important leadership. But then the true test of leadership is to disappear after you led the community. So in my opinion, the quintessential leader in my, uh, in, in, uh, in, according to my vision is George Washington. He served mm. for one term, he served yeah. for another term, and then all of a sudden he retired and became a private citizen. And 200 and change years later, we still are with some defects, but we have done a lot of things right. And we have been able to evolve. That to me is success in leadership. Well, instead, you contrast our experiment with a lot of experiment. I've done so much, so well, that I want another four years. And why shouldn't I be only a four and I have another eight? Yeah. <laughs> why should it be another eight? Give me 16 and we'll fix all your problem. And now then is the type, in my opinion, of failed leadership. The leadership ought to be really lead, ignite, and disappear. And if you don't disappear, the system is going to die with you. And it's not a good idea for everybody else.